Ignite here, I'm back with another video for you. Uh, again, we're going to go into a, another comparison video of two very like ants. We're going to be going looking at Dark Giant and New World General. But before we get into that, to make it real quick, this video is sponsored by Aptoids, where using my code Ignite5 can get you anywhere from 5 to 40% off any in-game purchase. In the description below, there will be a full video explaining how to take advantage of this. Uh, as well as a link to my Discord down below where we do do uh, giveaways. Uh, we're about to have a $500 giveaway that I'll be doing very soon to whoever who is subscribed and in my Discord. Alright, with that out of the way, let's get right into it. So like always, we compare the skills that the ant actually has. Um, and from there, we compare them one-on-one -on -one with the placement that they have. Now, as always... We're going to ignore Dominance, Colony Leader, um, ter uh, Tertiary Defense, and Tertiary Attack, as those are the same with both ants. So we'll get right into it. So skill 2 for Dark Giant. Uh, in the first four rounds, reduces the damage taken by our squad with the least soldier ants by 25% each round, and grants a random, uh, random squad a 25% chance to dodge the next incoming attack. Uh, damage so that's pretty effective um it again it's like it's like having a shield warden or a banshee panda um where you reduce the damage actually received which for carriers is nice because carriers uh, they're mostly health based so having that little bit of damage reduction is a plus and we'll go look at new world general has a 30% chance to deal 176.5% uh, damage, plus special ant level one uh, times 1.5, damage to two random enemy squads within effective range, and increase their damage taken from combat skills by 21% for one round. So right away you can see that um, Dark Giant is going to be more bases as a support, whereas New World General is basically trying to stack the damage um, that it's putting out now it's something to note is for the dark giant um its skill two is 100 percent proc so that means every round it will proc whereas for new world general it only has a 30 percent chance to proc which that's not very good at all and we'll get into the next one um which for new world general is in the first four rounds reduce the combat skill damage of two random enemies squad by 35 percent so that's effective and that's kind of going back to how um dark giants skill two is and this is part of the reason why these ants are very similar um now the only main difference with that is dark giants lasted for all the rounds where this is only the first four rounds so you would need it backed by some pretty strong um DPS ants for the skill to really be effective to where you can pretty much end the fight within the first four rounds And we'll go look at dark giant Has a 30% chance to deal 399% damage plus special ant level times three which that is pretty high um, damage to one enemy random enemy squad within the effective range and reduce all of our squad's damage taken by Guardian Ants by 30% for two rounds. Now, you don't really run into too many uh, Guardian mains. Um, so, the part with the whole reducing damage from Guardians, um, I don't think is really a big deal. The one thing, too, looks, even though it has a high damage threshold, uh, it only has a 30% chance of proc. So, it's kind of like New World General's skill, too, is. But... It is good to note of just how much higher that potential damage when it does release is. Uh, 399 plus uh, special ant level times 3% for every level, so that's times 50. That gets pretty up there pretty fast. And we'll look at the next one. Um, when there are only carry ants in the three squads, from the first round, increases combat skill damage of two random squads by 60% for four rounds. That's effective, and that means it's also something that procs no matter what. So if you have this with, like, Dusky, or not Dusky, uh, 
if you have this with uh, like shikri and golden crystal that's a huge damage increase plus you're also having the benefit of reducing some of the incoming damage um, that you have coming in in the first place so that's that's pretty good and then we'll go look at new world general which is prepare for one round has a 40 percent chance to attack two times dealing 269 plus special ant level times two uh damage uh each time to one random enemy squad within the effective range so this is kind of like how uh dark giants skill was i had the 30 percent chance um this is kind of trying to mimic that but it does have a lower threshold than the dark giant so which is better um overall i believe that that dark giant is the better uh ant not only because it has a slightly higher proc rate um, plus it has guaranteed things that will happen per round um whereas even like with this last skill it's a prepare for one round so that means and it's only a 40 percent chance to proc so that means out of you know nine rounds it only has the possibility of proccing four of those rounds um so that's something to look at i think overall that uh dark giant's going to be your better choice um again like i said for the guaranteed proc rate um, plus the possibility of having a high damage threshold on one of the skills and new world general in use it just it just never seems to proc at all um so yeah those are my thoughts um i definitely think that Jesky Lurker, or not, god damn, I definitely think that uh, Dark Giant is the better choice out of these two ants. I hope you enjoyed, throw a like on there, subscribe, and Agnes out, we'll see you in the next one.